Hi guys, it's Minx here. I hope you're doing well. The last Cubescape game that I have yet to play that's currently available looks like this is Cubescape Theatre. Um, let's uh, try it out, shall we? And see what uh, is going to go down in this episode. Rusty Lake 1972. Again, this is often a recurring theme, I feel. The lake is changing my memories. My past isn't what it seems to be. I will let the cubes guide me. I'm not sure that's a good idea, cubes. Probably not. So obviously still, I think we're still playing Dale, obviously. Trapped in his weird Rusty Lake related world. 1971, the theatre. We saw the theatre on that poster, right? In the previous one. In uh, Birthday, I think. Alright, what do we have here? Very small theatre. Hello, sir. Give that man a drink. Thank you. Where's my drink? Leave me alone. I just want a drink. Okay, well, I guess we need to... Oh, I want that, actually. Dear Bob, as you know, I've not been feeling well for a while now. I'll be staying at the lake. I told you about. I'm sorry this didn't work out. Perhaps we'll meet in another life. And then she died. That's pretty fucking sad. Um, and he's obviously heartbroken, I guess. What do we have here? Screwdriver cocktail, two, do two times vodka, two times orange juice. That seems pretty easy to make so <coughs> mix all this up voila and in the cocktail glass it goes fantastic we're making some good progress here maybe depressed man wants it hello do you like the screwdriver do you like it did you like it did you like it? Hey! Oh god, it's gonna be a fucking screwdriver, isn't it? Yes! That's fine! I don't mind! That isn't weird at all. What do you want, detective? Okay, well, I mean, we know that we want to ask you about this fucking woman, right? Why can't I tell. What do you Fuck want, off. detective? I gave him a drink. The show starts. When the light is on. The show starts when the light is on. Okay. I guess we need to put the light on, probably, or something like that. Oh, God. I fucking... I don't like these at all. Some sort of tile puzzle of some description. Okay. Oh, okay, this is pretty simple, maybe? Maybe. Alright. This one's gonna be the harder, I feel. You know? Definitely. Definitely the harder. All right, there we go with this one. Perfect. That was really hard. Um, really, really fucking difficult, actually, to be honest with you. Okay, what do we have here? Dead face. So we have to play D-E-A-D-F-A-C-E. -E. Right, that would be right. So let's see. Right? So, is it like proper music or is there any clues that we're meant to be reading here? Oh, here we go, yeah. All right, so it's um, going to be, let me just write this out just so it makes sense. Two, three, um, one, two, three, four, two, three, six, two, four, Six. One. Three. Two, three, six, two, four, six, one, three. Let's try that. So it is like a normal piano, right? Like it's like, they actually use the right notes. So it'd be... Uh...
Did it in the end. It was like Simon says. Sorry I was silent there, guys. I was just trying to focus. All right. Got a key to something or some some butthole, probably. It's probably to open an anus. Let's be honest with you. It's all I can think of. Let's see what else we can do. What can I open with this? Nothing that seems apparent. Maybe the toilet? Can I open the toilet? Yeah, I can. Got a heart. Cocktail glass. Anything in the toilet? No. Lovely. Lo oh, hi. Hi, Dale's face. Hi, mirror. Oh, I have to match it up? Oh, I guess I did nothing wrong. What's happening to me? I don't really care, to be honest with you, Dale. What I care about is what's behind this fucking mirror here. Can we get any of this other shit off with a screwdriver or some shit? I want to see behind it. Fine. Fine. So it's like... Square... Wiggly thing... Circle with the dot in it... Thing. I'm gonna make a note of that as well. I started to learn that I needed to take my notes in this game way more than I did. Because a lot of my fuck-ups in this series is probably down to the fact that I just forget to fucking write shit down half the time. If I'm perfectly honest with you. So, uh... That's not very numb, if you ask me. In fact, I would definitely say it probably is... Pretty fucking bum. What else can we do here? Anything else in the toilet? Got this. Is this relevant to anything? No, can't click on that. What is this? Can I fix this? With a screwdriver? Yes, I can. Right. Oh, okay, and then the lights on the show begins. Right? Show. Let the good times roll. Welcome to the theatre of your mind. It's Mr. Al, I guess. What he's meant to be. My name is Mr. Al. I'm aware. And this evening I present to you six plays. Oh god, they're gonna be horrible puzzles, aren't they? Of the past, the present, and the future. It's showtime. Showtime. Hi Harvey, how's it going? It's very eloquent, well done. The Lady of the Lake. Okay. So this is like Mrs. Pheasant as a human, right? Oh god. What the fuck just happened there? Balance the substance of my past life. Okay. So we got a hat, a heart. A plunger, I mean, I don't think they're relevant. Oh, can I put, uh, I can, I can do this, right? I can match this from the thing from before. So it's like, I need the weird little thing that I wasn't really sure what it was. That thing. Circle with a dot in it. And then the weird crucifix thing. What am I doing wrong? I'm pretty sure that's definitely what it was. I really am. Uh, I get those. I got. The, I actually get those mixed up, don't I? Hang on. I I I did this exactly the same thing before. I'm pretty sure. There we go. Got a shell. Fucking hell, it's a shell. Did, did did you like did you like that? I, I thought I thought that was pretty good, but um, you know, if you didn't, I'm I'm really sorry. What else can we do? Oh, we've got a plunger. Why don't we use the plunger on the toilet? I didn't think about that. Right. So give it a good old plunge, and it's a dead baby. Great. So I'm assuming we need to put these things and balance these out. Balance 
the substance of my past. Okay, so we've got a heart, a fetus, a shell, and a hat, right? So we, we have to get them to weigh the same or something, or... I mean, I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay, they balance. This is it. There we go. Thank you. Thank you, Mrs. Pheasant. You were great. I thought you were the best in the show. I promise. Please fuck off. I guess I didn't click it enough times the first time. Yeah, okay. The sign. Okay. So we have to build this is like the one with the in roots with like the war. Right? Right, maybe. This definitely goes there. Okay, so that's the highest that one can go. So that means that has to go there. Right. Um, we need the bottom of this as well, though. Like, the bottom of this is definitely missing. Is that it? Yeah. So now we need the other part of the cube, which is there. So that goes there. Okay. Okay. This is going fine. Okay, so I remember that. Okay. Probably going to be fine. Is this meant to happen? I'm, I'm, I'm a bit little worried right now. A bit little, a bit little worried? Can I open up the bottom of the thing with that? So it's like... Cross circle cube, no circle triangle. So it's like, it would be... Um... Cross circle, cube down here. No circle, and then the weird triangle thing, right? Yes. Harvey Wallbanger. Two juice, one, whatever that says, and vodka. So, two juice, one of this thing, and two vodka. Okay, I guess that's enough. I was just wondering one vodka. Why is why is it hopping by? Its oh, there we go. And what do we have? We have a Harvey wall banger. I'm guessing somebody needs this. Does he need it? That man looks like he could use another. Drink. Okay, you got another one coming down your throat, dude. Oh. I guess that's why it's called a wall banger. I don't remember. I'm not happened. really surprised after you did that, to be honest with you. We got some blood. Fantastic. Anything else we can do? Screwdriver, no. Can we make like a thing with the blood? Yeah, we can. Great. Is that enough? I don't know what I'm doing here, to be honest with you. Um, what goes in a Bloody Mary? Is that what we're making? Well, obviously not real blood, but... That's Tabasco. And... Vodka? Wrong cocktail, okay. Blood? Tabasco. Vodka. More blood. That's going to work this time, hopefully. Bloody Mary. Okay, cool. So we've got a Bloody Mary drink. Bob. It's your own blood. So, you know. If you had AIDS, it's not really a problem. Of course. Of course. Hang on, hang on. I want, I want the fucking... Jesus Christ. Let's go through this again. So he goes here. We've got some cubes. He's thinking about the woman. We get the other cube, obviously, and then we go out the other side of his head, I think. I'm not really sure. 
But you know, you know what I mean. Okay. I think he's dead. To be honest with you. When can't live with them. Yeah, I think that's an easy, rational way to explain that, to be honest with you. Anything else I need to do here? I mean, that seems to be it. Can we just go in the next act? The fish and the parrot. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right, flare in here. We've got a fish and Harvey putting on the show of their lives here. We've got to do the best thing. This is the same as the one where you get 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 them pregnant, right? In fucking Roots as well. Um. That work? Okay, that went to the fish. Fish, you happy? You flying? Y'all be swell. Y'all be great. Gonna have a fish on a plate. Okay, um. What's next? An intermezzo by Mr. Croft. Alright. We just click what he's wanting us to. So it's pretty simple. I just noticed the barman's playing all the characters in this, right? One, two, three. One. One. Two. Three. One. Two, two. I fucked up there. Three. One. Two, three, two, one. You know what to do. Oh, blood. You know what to do. I, 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 I actually have no idea what to do. Mr. Fucking Crow, click. You know what to do. Oh, okay. It's the one he's looking at. Right there. We done? Great. That was the best act in the show, I think. Remember the so this is a reference back to Rusty Lake Seasons. This looks like the, um, like this, right? Cherry Blossom, Moon. Is that what we can do here? I think we're almost right there. Maybe slightly off. Let's double check again. So the tree, the tree is fully behind her, and it's just like the top. You don't see her hands. Okay, we're getting there though. So tree is fully behind her. We did it, I think. Oh, shit. I need some more fucking cubes. That I don't have. So what am I missing? What other stuff is there? Can we make, like, our own cocktail? Like, let's try gin and tonic. It's a well-known cocktail. We've got gin and tonic there, so I'm assuming that's something. Let me just... I just can't do it, can I? Because I've got the fucking... Give me that fucking glass, cunt. Let's try that again. Gin. Two gins. If it doesn't mix, it doesn't mix. What other can we make with them? I can't even see what that says, the one in the middle. It's like... Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. 
We've got a gin and tonic. Let's try him drinking that. I know he's dead, but it's worth a shot, right? Yeah, he's still going to drink it even though he's dead. More cubes, please. That didn't work at all, did it? Um, another one. That's good. Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck is this shit? What the fuck is this shit? I don't know what goes in his fucking fucking brain. I've no idea what goes in his fucking brain. Okay, maybe there's another cube beforehand that I'm missing. We have to look through the different routes, okay? So we got this. That's the first straightforward route. Found it. There was another fucking cube hiding behind his hair. Okay. But these aren't in the fucking picture though, right? And this one isn't finished. I'm still missing one, right? Right? Like, where does this one... This one's really fucking hard to, to fucking... Position. Five, two, five. Is that right? I've, what what's going on? <laughs> Four. Can't click on that one. I'm so fucking confused. So I don't know how that works at all. I, I looked up a guide and I still don't really understand what happened, but. You can go through this guy's head. Oh, I went to the wrong fucking entrance. Go through this guy's head to the door, and the code for the door is 7285. I'm sorry, guys, but I've been sitting here for 20 minutes, and I have no idea. The 7 and 2, the 7 and, uh, sorry, the 5 and 2 I get, but I don't know why, where I get the other ones from. 5 and 2 are on the fingers, but I don't understand. Regardless, we're going in here now, and we got a black cube. Fantastic. Don't go in there anymore. Go, 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 let's leave. Just fuck off. Just fucking leave. <laughs> That's really nice. Great. I'm glad that fucking act's over. Jesus, I was sitting, sitting here for half an hour on that. Half an hour. I know I'm an idiot, but Jesus, that was tough. That was really fucking tough. What's next? Hello, Mr. L. Are you ready for the final play? Oh god, no, probably not. I'm not I'm not gonna it's not gonna work, is it? His memories belong to the lake now. Extracting them caused a corrupted soul. One of the six stages. I don't fully understand still. <laughs> Okay, so we have some weird symbols that I don't recognize. Probably Hindu in nature, I want to say, but maybe that's just racist of me. I don't actually fucking know what it's called, but still. Um... Okay, there's some some horrific kind of puzzle that I don't understand. All right, guys, I had to look this up too. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, but I, I don't even again. I don't understand the basic premise of this puzzle. So it's yellow, pink, red. Orange, blue, white. Uh, I, I still don't know why. This is... Uh, I mean, they've been getting increasingly harder, but this is definitely, like, the the craziest one in terms of difficulty. Your mind is reaching a higher state of consciousness. You are learning about your past and your future. What you may become. Now, continue your journey. Here we go. Oh, I guess we're going to get a hop in the elevator and yeah, fuck off out of here. Um. Go. I'm just going, I'm just running. To be continued. 
Interesting. Well, that was Cube Escape Theater. Definitely the toughest of all of them, for me at least, in terms of the puzzles. Like, I just didn't get a large chunk of them, especially the picture one, and especially that weird text one at the end there. Just whoosh, over my head. Lots of stuff that was a lot more, like, cryptic and difficult to find as well. Like, I still... I'm, I mean, like, I guess, like, most people know what a gin and tonic is and things like that, so that's not too bad. But, like... Interesting. It's very interesting. So, that was Cooper's Cape Theater. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, leave a like. Please leave a comment as well. You can bollock me for being shit in the comment section below. And, uh, please remember to share the video with as many people as you can. Uh, if you enjoy my content and you want to support me further, gamewist.com forward slash minx. Link in the description for that. It's, uh, like Patreon. Lots of rewards on offer. You can also buy some shirts. And, finally, follow me on Twitter, at Mangaminx, to get all the latest updates on my videos in a far more reliable way than YouTube itself. So, at Mangaminx on Twitter. Link in the description for that too. And I'll see you guys really soon. Have a great day. Bye for now. Bye for now. Like, um, three, all in one. Oh. You feel scared, Minx? The door is locked, so we can't go in. I guess now we can probably go and open the other door. Now we've, now we've like, deep throated a banana in seven seconds. We can go and open the other door. The fear begins. I, bet, I mean, you know, it's important to stay. You know, energize with the right nutrients before I need to sleep. I need to sleep. I like the fact yeah. they just they didn't even bother like having a translation or something, it's just both text just in case. At once. But wasn't that wasn't that a 